want to talk a little bit about dial indicators uh, and how they can be useful uh, when tuning engines. A dial indicator takes linear motion and it converts it to rotary motion as is displayed here when you run it up and down. And what we use this for is to uh, find the position of valves, uh, the position of the piston, top dead center, bottom dead center. Uh, you can use it to set the ignition timing. Once you find top dead center, you can back off uh, approximately 10, 12 degrees, whatever your spec reads, and set the point gap or the point uh, to break at that point. And uh, you can um, check port timing in relation to bottom dead center, top dead center, with the use of a degree wheel. Now this degree wheel happens to be for a V8. Uh, not for two stroke, but it could be adapted or you can purchase one. Basically what all the degree wheel is, is a wheel that is bolts directly to the center of the crankshaft and uh, indicates 360 degrees. Simple as that. You Build yourself a little uh, feeler that feels off the edge. You find a position, it doesn't matter where it is, and you set it to whatever the position. If you find bottom dead center, you position it to zero, top dead center, you position it to zero, and then you go forward or backward in relationship to that point. Now, dial indicators generally just don't fit in the head. Uh, I made these adapters a long time ago. This is a little one, a, a screw type. So it slides through, you put your indicator in there and set the set screw. This other one is actually a compression, it's a split bushing. You just kind of wedge it in there. Uh, it holds securely, it's a good one. Um, what I found the bad part about this one is there wasn't a lot of uh, room to bite it with a socket. And so you need to be able to get to this one, it was for a confined space. Uh, the other one I used a standard spark plug hex and so I could just stick a plug wrench on it and run it in and uh, that's what we use dial indicators for I hope that helps some people that may or may not have known